Why is that? Because in the, in, in the defense in the Netherlands, we say we protect what we think is important, what we cherish. And that's our values, that's our prosperity, that's our safety, our well-being. And we need trade for that, we need friends for that, we need alliances for that. And we need a free flow of, of goods and, and of commercial stuff. And these ships will keep our oceans, our seas, our ports open so in, to ensure that economies can go on. Uh, and without a mine hunting capacity, uh, the uh, supply chain of the Netherlands, of Belgium, of Europe, well, of the free world, is uh, at risk. So we need those ships. So we have uh, the program with the Belgians to build uh, 12 identical ships. Uh, and there will be no difference otherwise than the, the crew manning the ships and the, the names, but uh, the rest will be identical. Uh, and that also makes the training, the education uh, and the operations uh, easier. Uh, so even the maintenance of the vessels will be done together with the Belgians. So yeah, they are perfectly identical. The current status of the program and this is uh, ship number two of uh, 12 that uh, will be built. Uh, the first one uh, is, uh, we had the ceremony in uh, November last year. Um, so we are looking for the building 12 ships uh, for the next, uh, next three, four years. And the first one will be delivered in 2024. The first Dutch one will be 2025. Uh, and from that point on, we will have like every six months a ship uh, delivered. So it's going to be a uh, quite long uh, program, but uh, a nice program. I'm very happy to be here to contribute to uh, the future of the uh, Dutch uh, Navy with the ski laying ceremony. Of course, we are challenged. Uh, we have suffered an increase in price in the raw materials and especially steel that is used uh, for uh, our work here. Uh, but um, we can buy some steel. Uh, it's a question of price today, question of inflation. Uh, but if I can extend a little bit the, the topic, uh, uh, we need also uh, people. Uh, we need raw material, but we need people. And I'm very glad that today uh, defense industry is seen in France, is seen in Europe as absolutely key for the future of our society and uh, that we will be also to uh, have in our shipyards uh, the best of our young people, young engineers, because we need raw material and we are suffering from inflation, but we need also people and uh, it's, uh, it's, a, it's a challenge also, but uh, confident uh, that uh, defense industry is today uh, well seen in, in what we bring to our people.